Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be the winter introduction to my project Use It Up. I'm so excited to share with you guys. I am putting in pretty much all new products for the winter. I just finished my fall finale yesterday. You can go check out that video. But today we are doing a winter introduction and I have a lot of fragrances to introduce to you guys. I have some little um, combo sets just like I did in the fall. I think that was a lot of fun. And a lot of the things that I'm putting in now, I don't have like a full set on. So that's why I'm pretty much gonna do a combo. So yeah, I have some exciting stuff to share with you guys. So let's go ahead and get on into it. Okay, I don't even know where to start first, but I think I'm gonna start with the set that I have pretty much the most of. So I'm gonna pull that up real quick. So the first set that I'm introducing is Winter Berry Wonder. Now this one is from 2020. I've had these for quite some time and I just never finished them up. So I have two full size products and then this one is actually a little bit used. So we're gonna start with the Winter Berry Wonder Body Lotion, completely unused. The notes are Ruby Frost Winter Berry, Sparkling Cranberry and Crystal Vanilla. And the lotion is still like completely good but I wanted to go ahead and start using it because I've been kind of craving this scent and they brought it back out this winter so I know you guys have a chance to actually pick it up so I wanted to share it with you guys as well and I will be doing a review on this one um, after I use it for like a week or so I will do a review on this one for you guys but it is really a beautiful like cranberry berry scent I don't even it's just like a very simple berry scent and then for the oh I didn't show you the shower gel is this beautiful, like, frosty packaging. I love this. But you can definitely still see inside of it, and it is um, unused, so it is right up here at the very beginning of the project. And then I do have the Body Butter. This is also from 2020. And this one I have used quite a bit of. I have about a third left of it. Let's see if you can even see the inside. Yeah, you can. But this one smells really good. I love their body butter formula. It's super moisturizing. Really nice for right after you um, shave. Such a good moisturizing product. So that is Winterberry Wonder in the body lotion, shower gel, and the body butter. And to go with it, I am gonna put in a fine fragrance mist and a perfume, as well as a body scrub. So I do have here the Scentsy Sugar Scrub in Appleberry. So this one I have not used before. I did pick it up during their summer clearance event. So I'm actually gonna open it right now with you guys because I don't remember what it smells like. I think I smelled it when I first bought it, but it is a white sugar scrub. It looks really thick. Mm. Wow, that smells amazing. Definitely is super apple-y and like actually a little bit of cranberry. So these two go perfectly together. So I'm gonna put the scrub in and then for the fragrance, we're gonna use this combo. So this is the Winter Wishes perfume from Mary Kay. This is so old, I've had this since high school. I think I put it in last winter's Project Use It Up. Um, it does have some lines on it, but it is right about here. So I have like 25% left of it. It is just like a really simple sparkly berry scent, maybe with like violet in it, I think, but this is from like 20, 13 maybe. So this is old. I definitely need to get it used up. And then for the Fine Fragrance Mist, I'm putting in Ice Sugar Plum. I just picked this up at the sale they had for Fine Fragrance Mist. The notes on this are Sparkling Sugar Plum, Snowdrop Petals, and Whipped Marshmallow. Mmm, this is so yummy. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Kind of makes me think of like a winter version of Beach Nights. That's what it reminds me of, but without the like airy kind of scent super nice and gourmand with like that plum berry note oh my gosh i think that this combo is going to be really good so that is the first combo basically just like a nice berry wonderland the next combo that i'm putting in is christmas cookies and i have it in two different types of formats so i have the bath and body works christmas cookies from 2020 this is the um this was actually the same packaging weird 
they don't really look the same they have the same font though but yeah this is both from 2020 you can tell the lotion is starting to turn a little yellow that's because it has a lot of vanilla in it the notes on this are creamy cookie dough almond biscotti and caramel woods mm, christmas cookies is such a good calming relaxing sweet sugary scent oh my gosh i'm so excited to use the lotion i think i have used it before because it's not like completely full but i will mark it where it's at it's pretty much full and then for the fine fragrance mist it's also pretty much full um you can even tell it's it's right about here i did mark that one already so yeah this one is also pretty full <laughs> Oh my gosh, and it smells so good. I cannot wait to start using Christmas cookies. And to go with it in the shower, I have the Philosophy Christmas Cookie Shower Gel Mini. This is the three-in-one um, shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath combo. This is in a little um, six fluid ounce bottle, and it smells delectable. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. This to me kind of smells more like a butter cookie than anything else. Mm, it smells so good. So I think that's going to be like the perfect combo in the shower. And then I do have something else to put in with it. I am also putting in Vanilla Bean Noel in the confetti body scrub. Oh, sorry, the whipped sugar body scrub. It does have the little confetti sprinkles in it, though. You can see right here, it's got the red and green sprinkles in it. I really love this uh, whipped sugar scrub formula. The notes on Vanilla Bean Noel from 2022. Oh my gosh, wait. I, I bought this at SAS and it says that it was made in 2022. So I guess they made it for SAS. That's kind of weird. This is not this year's packaging, is it? No, no, I don't think it is. Anyways, the notes are fresh vanilla bean, sugar cookies, warm caramel, whipped cream, and snow kissed musk. I don't remember sugar cookies ever being part of the vanilla bean Noel scent notes. So that's weird, but anyways, Smells delicious. I had this last year and I loved it. So I'm super excited to put that in the shower. I think that the, these two together, they're gonna be so yummy in the shower. I'm gonna be smelling like I'm baking cookies in the shower. And then I am gonna put in a perfume to go with it. And this is the Dossier Musky Musk perfume. This one on me smells really unique. This is one of those ones that, um, it doesn't really have scent notes, it just, matches with your pH balance of your skin and kind of creates its own unique scent for every single person that uses it. So this one for me is kind of, I, it's musky. I don't know what else to say. It's musky, but it also is like a tad bit floral. I just think this will mix really well with my Christmas cookies um, body lotion because this to me once it dries down and has some time to soak into my skin, it kind of gives me a little bit of a musky scent. So I think these two together will be really good, but that is my Christmas cookies combo. And then probably the one that I'm most excited about is coconut mint drop and these other minty scents. Um, this is not really like a complete set. I don't have a shower gel to go with it yet. It's not body care day yet, so I haven't picked up any um, Christmas shower gels. So for now, it's just gonna be lotion and fine fragrance mist, but this is Coconut Mint Drop from 2020. Again, the notes on this are white coconut, iced peppermint, and winter musk. I love this scent, you guys. I'm so sad they haven't brought it out yet this year. I hope they bring it out. Maybe for SAS they will, but they probably won't, which is really sad because this scent is so yummy. They came out with it um, as a Canada exclusive in, let me grab it, in the packaging here, mint chocolate swirl. So this was available at certain select um, outlet stores and it was actually a Canada exclusive last year, but it basically is the same thing as coconut mint drop. It smells exactly the same. So yeah, but they did not have it in any other form besides a mist. So I didn't get to pick it up in lotion or shower gel or anything really, but I've used this in the past and absolutely adored it. This is so yummy and it's, it's like really nostalgic to me. It is such a great scent. So that's coconut mint drop. And then to pair with it, I do have the Hemp's Baked in CBD Minty and Mellow Peppermint Moisturizer. So this one has the cutest packaging ever. And it basically is just like a minty um, body lotion. 
it kind of smells like Andy's mints. Maybe not as much chocolate, but that's the kind of mint that I get. I don't get candy cane, I don't get peppermint. I get like that Andy's mint kind of mint. So I think these two together will be really great. I'm probably gonna have this finished off in less than a month. So as a backup, I have Twisted Peppermint in the Body Lotion. This one is also from 2020. I went ham on Christmas in 2020, so I have a lot of leftovers. But the notes are Cool Peppermint, Sugared Snow, Vanilla Buttercream, Vanilla Buttercream, and Fresh Balsam. So this one also, I think I've used it a few times, but it is pretty much full. Um, Twisted Peppermint is just a classic vanilla peppermint scent. So nice and simple and sweet and yummy. So that is Twisted Peppermint, and I'll put that in after I finish off the little mini Minty Mellow Mint, or Minty Mellow Pebble Mint. <laughs> so yeah, that is my like little mint, coconut mint combo. I am going to be on the lookout for a shower gel to pick up at body care day, but besides that, this is going to be the combo for now. And just a little random here, the Peppermint Essential Oil Aromatherapy Body Lotion. I've had this in the projects that I've been doing for the past like six months, and I've been using this at my work from home desk pretty much every single day. I'll use this like quite a few times a day. I really love it. It's a nice relaxing scent, but um, I am right about here on this one, so I imagine I will finish it up in December. So I'm just gonna put this in the project to finish it off, but this is gonna be used as a hand lotion, which is perfect because it already has a pump. And for my last scent combo, I have a vanilla coffee scent combo going. These are all different scents and all different brands. So I wanted to put them all together because I think that they will smell really good in combination. So the first thing that I have is the Vanilla Mocha Cream Body Cream from Bath & Body Works. This is from last year. Um, this was the winter edition. They've come back out with it again as Vanilla Mocha Martini. And this is honestly one of my favorite scents from them. The notes are Cozy Cappuccino, Vanilla Orchid, and White Tonka Bean. Such a good cozy coffee scent with a little bit of chocolate and a little bit of vanilla. Such a great scent. So that is the body cream. And then for the shower gel, I'm gonna be using the OGX Coconut and Coffee Scrub and Wash. I love this stuff, especially if I'm gonna do like a morning shower. I love a nice coffee scent in the morning. So this one's gonna go in the project. It is like a coconutty coffee scent. And honestly, it's not a scrub. It has these coffee grounds in it and you can kind of see it. Yeah, here's the buildup. That's where it's actually at um, on the bottle. That's how much I have left. But um, yeah, it's definitely not a scrub. The coffee grounds in it aren't like enough to scrub, but it is a really nice lather. Um, when you put this on like a loofah or something, it is like a really rich lather. So I do love this one. And to go with it for the spray, I am gonna be using the VS Pink Whipped Dream. This is Cake Sprinkles and Vanilla Caramel. So here's this one. I believe I put this in my winter project last year too. And I am right about here on it. So I've used like an eighth of it. I definitely need to get more use out of it. It is like a really nice, to me it's more like a marshmallow caramel scent. So I think it'll go really well with like a coffee flavor. So it'd be like a coffee, um, a, what is that called? A white chocolate and chocolate like a turtle. What is that called? You know when they do white chocolate and chocolate on a coffee? Can't think of what it's called. But um, this will be like a really nice coffee and then you have like the marshmallow on top of the coffee or something. I don't know. I feel like it's gonna be really nice. So that's the combo right there. And then to go with it, I do actually have a mini perfume that I'm going to attempt to try this month. I've never tried it before. This is the Tom Ford Ebony Fume. Um, I don't know if this is actually a unisex scent it is super musky and strong wow this smells amazing it kind of smells like a wood burning fire that's what it reminds me of so i think this will be really fun to put in with that kind of like coffee scent so we'll, tr we'll try it out i've never used it before so we'll just see but here's where i'm at pretty much unused on that one so we're gonna put that in and the last thing that's going to be going in with that scent combo is the Creme Shop X Hello Kitty 2-in-1 Fusion Body Scrub in Caramel Pumpkin Latte. So this is definitely a fall scent and Hello Kitty right here, she's dressed in her Halloween costume, but it is a coffee scrub. It is really nice and soft and gentle and that's really what I wanted because I do have the Tree Hut coffee scrub, 
but that one is super thick and abrasive and I wanted something gentle that I could use every day. This one looks like a moisturizer. So you can see right here, I've used it a few times. I believe I have a shower routine with it and I'll link it up above. I think it's a coffee or pumpkin spice latte shower routine. Um, but this one is super gentle. It is very moisturizing. I feel like I could use this every single day and that's really what I want in my shower. I want one that I can use every single day and then one that's a little more coarse that I can use just whenever I'm gonna shave, which is like twice a week. Um, so this will be my super gentle one and the Scentsy one will be like the super abrasive one. And then whenever I want some vanilla, I'll pull in Vanilla Bean Noel. So that is all of the sugar scrubs. So yeah, that is everything for my winter Project Use It Up introduction. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I know I introduced a lot of products. Um, I'm gonna do like a pan over of everything that I put in the project because I feel like it was a lot and I didn't, I wasn't able to hold up everything that was in each scent combo. So I'll just give you guys a little overview. But yeah, that's everything that I'm putting in. It's a little ambitious, but I think I can get through quite a bit of this, maybe like half of it, I can definitely get through in the winter time. So this project is starting December 1st and it'll go through January and February and end in February. And then March will start my spring project use it up. So yeah, that is everything for this introduction. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down below, what are you wearing? this winter? Are you wearing new scents? Are you wearing old scents? Because I'm wearing a combination of both. You guys know I'm wearing coconut mint drop and iced sugar plum. So I'm doing a little bit of a combination here, but I'm definitely going to pick up more on body care day. So I might have some new things to put in come January, but that's what I'll be focusing on in December. And it's going to be a cozy Christmassy time. So make sure you're subscribed and you have bell notifications turned on because I will be doing daily uploads in December. I hope you guys are ready. Also, happy candle day. It is starting tonight slash tomorrow. So happy candle day. So that's everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.